Hi, honeys. How's your day going so far? Mine is going fine. Okay, I have another Home Chef unboxing. Meals everyone will love. And the man just banged on my dough like he was the popo to make sure, you know, I, I was aware that it was on my porch. So that was okay. So I'm going to open this. And yesterday, I canceled. I told him don't send me uh, any more, even though I like this. But I still got last Monday's uh, two meals for two people. I haven't cooked it, so I'm not gonna let my stuff go to waste. I got two more gift cards that I can share with somebody. $35 off. They all come packaged up the same way. This got three envelopes. Open me for delicious deals. Why they give me three? Because they were stuck together. Let me see if, if it's all the same thing. Okay, that's good. That. They are the same thing. Homer Essential Early Learning Program for your little kids. I'm not using that. I'll show it to Amber, see if she wants it. The Myers uh, Cleaning Supplies. And Wayfair. I've shopped at Wayfair before. I like it. I think I had some furniture delivered. What is this? A $50 gift card oh, for a wine. Okay, I'm not using any of those. Here are this week's recipes. Mm -mm -mm. Hot honey barbecue chicken. Their meals are delicious. But I don't, I haven't been keeping up with the meals I got, so it don't make sense to keep getting food delivered, and I haven't cooked what was here already, because I wind up cooking or I get takeout. Steak fondue sliders with Parmesan cheese sauce. You can keep that Parmesan. Can't stand the smell of it. Walter either. So, I wonder if the bread going to be in here too. It's supposed to be. Oh, they got potato salad. Well, we're going to see what's in here. Okay. They always package the boxes up very nicely. This is very insulated. You see how the food is down there? The whole box is insulated. From the sides and the top and the bottom. Okay. Well, this is heavy. Oh, they got all these potatoes in here. Tomato. What is that? Brew pub style mustard. Cream cheese. Okay, I'll open it. Is that the Parmesan? I still got the other Parmesan from my first box I ever had. Garlic salt. I always use garlic powder. These are the slider buns. What's this? What's that? I don't know what that is. I have no idea what this is. Let me read this. Baby argula, arugula, some kind of lettuce, arugula. Okay, that's what that is. I have to put on the slider. 
nice looking tomato nice and cold about to fall on the floor mayo three mayos that should should be enough for what i want to do the uh brew pub style mustard two ounces plain light cream cheese and a lot of I buy you kind of potatoes. So that's what the potato salad. So I'm gonna put this stuff back in here. And everything is nice and cold. Back. Except for that stinky cheese. Okay, let me put this aside. Now for the other meal. Pack it up nicely. So what is this? Hot honey barbecue chicken. And when I fix the meals, they do look just like the picture. And in my opinion, the meals are restaurant quality. Okay, string beans. What's this mess? Crumbled bacon. Look, this don't look like no bacon I ever fixed. Okay. They say so. This is cheddar. Some kind of cheese. Carolina barbecue sauce. Lilies. Two of these. Oh, that's if you want to buy a bottle. Oh, I've seen this in the store. What's this? Hot honey. All right now. Mike's hot honey. Infused with chilies. Okay. I've had hot honey sauce from I think from Popeyes. What's this? What is this? Look like mashed potatoes. Can't smell through the pack. Let me read this. What is that on there? Mashed potatoes. It's loaded mashed potatoes. Okay. So it's supposed to look just like that. Put this back in here, then I'll show you the meat. I say everything is cold and fresh. Okay, now the bottom layer, it has a piece of cardboard right there, separating the other stuff from the meat. It has an ice pack. It's hot. So I've been keeping my ice packs, y'all, so I can refreeze them. Okay. this sliced beef strips okay so I've had this before the sliced beef strips when I cook some other meal this is 10 ounces so it breaks apart and it strips okay and chicken breast fillets so that's supposed to be enough for two people if you ain't greedy. All right. So I'm going to have to cook my other meals first. And what I did with the other meals, I had put them in the um, back of the refrigerator where it's the coldest spot. I put this on the uh, refrigerator shelf, put my meat on top of there, and then I put the bags on top of the meat. So it don't take up very much space. So when I got to cook this, I got to cook this within four days. 
and I got to cook the other one within six days by it being beef. So I might have to cook both of my other meals today. Because I ain't about to let them go bad. Let me look in here. Okay, nothing else in the box. Very nice insulation. If I had holes in my windows, this would be nice to put up against the windows. All right. So this is my unboxing of my home chef meals. This is my third. This is my third. Is it? Yeah, my third. Uh, I don't know. But anyway, the meals are very nice if you're going to keep up with them. They taste good. Everything you need is in here. So, I want to thank you all for watching. Give me a thumbs up. And leave a nice comment. And if you're interested in the home chef meals, then I'll leave my code in my description box. I forgot what it is offhand. And you can get $35 off of your first uh, subscription. It's a subscription meal box kit. Food kit. Yeah. Okay, so y'all be blessed and watch for my cooking. And maybe Walter, he'll be in the kitchen with me like he was the first time. Okay, bye. Be blessed. Do I need to hold up something? All right. And these menus are nice. You can put them in a binder and keep them. Bye for real now. Let me go.